Alright guys, so today I'm taking a look at what I think is very useful and very interesting little device just because it's got a laser and lasers are kind of cool. Uh, also, sometimes when you're trying to measure, a tape measure just is not going to work either because of the distance or it's just not feasible because of the flexibility. Uh, it's a little bit more difficult, so something like this can really come in handy. It's very small, probably about 5 by 2 inch roughly. Um, I don't know exactly how thick it is, but about 2 inches five inches so you have a two inch display it's backlit so that's really cool and it just uses two AAA batteries and it does come included with that also included is a little carrying pouch and a little lanyard if you decide you want to attach it you have a little quality control uh, indicator it's passed and then you have your instructional manual user manual user guide. It does have this little screen protector of sorts um, that you'll want to take off. And with this, you have different types of measurements depending upon what you're going to do. My primary measurement is just from here to there, you know, just, uh, you know, simple. Nothing too elaborate. So this is what it looks like. It's sort of a blue outline here and then just a black plastic you got your different buttons, which are nice and rubbery, very, uh, you know, good feel. You hear is a little bit of a feedback on that. And you can hear the little chime here, so. I don't know if you can see that. There you go. So you got your two-inch color display, and you've got, well, I'm not going to go through all the buttons. I'll throw an image up here. So you can kind of pause that and see what these buttons correspond to as far as function goes. But uh, yeah, super easy. And what I did to test this, just to make sure that it actually is accurate, which apparently it is pretty accurate. I just took a simple yardstick and I placed it up against a flat surface and I placed this at the end and it measured across and obviously 36 inches it was exactly 36 inches so at least mine came calibrated perfectly for you know for this shorter measurement I don't know if, if somehow over a long you know stretch that somehow would be um, inaccurate possibly I don't know for sure but that's basically what I wanted it for so I was able to uh, you know measure the bedroom which I knew roughly what it was and now I know it's right at 25 feet uh, so I was kind of curious about the bedroom size, uh, length. So yeah, um, other than that, you do have uh, 20, program, uh, 20 recall uh, measurements through the history button. You can mute or unmute the little chime that you uh, may have heard. I think you would hear that. And of course, you can change between different uh, units of measure. Uh, feet and inches are primarily what I'll use. Uh, meters, some people are going to use. And then... Um, the actual function of it you know you turn it on you hit the measure button it's pretty simple and as you move it if you're moving it you'll actually see the display in real time changing as the laser uh, changes you know the surface that it's bouncing off of or the distance between this device and whatever you're measuring so other than that I mean it's just it's a really lightweight and very accurate as I said and you can protect it when you carry it so it's really cool I like that they included the batteries in it it's very affordable so definitely a cool little item to have and then in addition to that it does have a bubble uh, level here and a bubble level here so you can actually use this you know to uh, you know get some things straightened up and make sure that they're the way they should be so yeah I, I don't really have a whole lot else to say about this because it's pretty self-explanatory it's kind of just a laser based tape measure of sorts uh, with some additional functionality for measuring different types uh, angles and sizes and, and such but you can read the details in the link below if you want to find out more about that my main goal is to tell you that one it works and I like that the batteries are included because that doesn't always happen and that it's accurate probably the most important thing I think that I can convey to you if you're looking for something like this is that this particular model um, I don't know how to pronounce the name, but it looks like Ace GMET. I don't know if it's pronounced differently, but it's the word Ace and then G-M-E-T. 
and this is the S9 you can see in the top corner there and this particular model at least mine is very accurate so there you go that's the main takeaway I think from this the only change I think I would really make to this is to give it more of a rubberized feel instead of this just solid hard plastic because it's not super slippery and it does have uh, I don't know if you can see the yeah you can see right there it does have some different uh, recessed areas so gripping it's fine but I think that that would make it just a little bit more easy to grip in your hand and not so slippery because it is a little bit slippery so anyway that's pretty much it you can attach the little lanyard right there if you're really worried about dropping it and and you can kind of you know keep it a little bit more retained easier so that's it I think I've spoken enough obviously it is a laser so not a child's toy not something that you want to uh, have hit you or anyone else in the eye so safe operation please when using it but uh, yeah just hold it down turn it on and if I hold down the button there for the measurement you can see it change as I move my hand in front of it you can also see if it just hits you know above to the ceiling I don't think it likes the light very much though <laughs> all right and hold it down to turn it off and I believe it shuts off automatically if you happen to leave it on or if you happen to turn it on uh, in your pocket or wherever you happen to be working with it so you don't have to worry about that uh, either in the long term so anyway I think I've rambled enough taking up enough of your time hopefully you find that useful there is a link below if you want to find out more and thanks for watching <laughs>